In this video, we're going to be looking at how we can resolve an issue in Revit 2025. Uh, the issue is when we uh, select a new level or create a new level, we can't actually see it in the project browser. So in Revit 2024, which I'm in right now, if I'm in uh, an, an elevation, in this case, east elevation, and I add a level, so this one here, it doesn't matter where I add it. As soon as I do that, you can see that in the project browser down here on the left, level two automatically comes in. Uh, and that's what you'd expect. And then you can see we've got all three levels there and I can have a look in level two, no problem at all. In Revit 2025, when I do exactly the same thing, uh, so if I go into architecture and then go into level, uh, when I create a new level in here, so from there to there, you can see that actually uh, in the project browser, there's no level in there. You've still got level zero and level one, but the new one that I put in level two is not there. And you can see that level two is all uh, not blue, it's, it's in black. Uh, so to, in order to get this uh, into our project browser, what we need to do is go into view. And when we're in view, go into plan views, go into floor plan, and then just click OK. And once you've done that, we can now see that our project browser uh, has now got our level two in. It's automatically opened up our level two plan view. And when we're in east, we can now see that all three are blue. So that's just a quick tip on how to um, seed level two uh, in Revit 2025.